Oh hi lads and lasses, didn't see you there. My name's Modest Pelican from Modest Pelican Gaming, where the production quality is dangerously low. For example, I'm literally using this plant to cover up a dodgy microphone with a sock on it. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please write to the Chinese and have them change the year 2020 to the year of the pelican instead of the year of the rat, as this would really help spread the good word of my channel. Welcome to the annual Pelican Christmas Special. I actually haven't done one every year, but annual Pelican Christmas Special has a charming ring to it. So over the last three years of me being a YouTuber, you've watched some seriously questionable gaming content and hopefully had a cheap laugh or two at the expense of others. Recently, I traveled away from my nest to drink with the guys I game with online all the time, as well as some of Australia's best and brightest content creators. Fuck, someone was doing it. Everyone, everyone just like strut. Before we get into all that though, I just want to say a massive thank you for helping me achieve a goal I wasn't even sure was possible. I was recently nominated for a finalist for the best Christian music educational media source and I actually managed to win it, which is pretty much a dream come true. Of course the competition was held by me on my Twitter account and only my Twitter followers voted, but I'm still incredibly proud of this achievement despite the overwhelming bias. Seriously though, I just wanted to say thank you for the support. This channel would be nothing without you guys. I sometimes can't believe that we've hit 400,000 uh, subscribers. Like I just feel like some guy with a laptop, a sock over a microphone and an average sized penis making videos. Yet somehow here we are and it's entirely thanks for you that I've been able to reach this. So from the bottom of my heart, Thank you. So you see the same people popping up in my videos, and this group is known as the Stealtho Boys. We're kind of like FaZe Clan, except without the success or the talent. These are the lads excluding Crosby7885, who's literally 14 years old and couldn't convince his parents to travel to Melbourne and drink with us for the weekend because they thought we were going to catfish him, which is pretty hilarious, but also good call parents. Remember the last time I tried to do a vlog and said that next time I'd make sure to have the proper equipment? Well, I didn't do that. It's all filmed on an outdated iPhone and my hand is shaking. Content. Not all the boys 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 had arrived yet, but those that had were enjoying a few mid-morning beers. The boys! <laughs> yeah. Hey! Got on, Jack. Got on, more. Good. Al? Hey. Good. I had to film it, I had to film it. Forgot our cover. How are you lads? Oh, good, good. Yeah, good. This is the most Australian shit I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> this is perfect, hey. Pretty good value for what? It's for what it's paid there, it's not easy. Still the rubber in the flesh, how you going, mate? I'm a bit tired and loose, but it's all good. <laughs> Also, the Airbnb we booked said it was five bedroom, but they counted this actual tiny cupboard on the stairs as one of them. Crosby didn't get catfished, but we most certainly did. They had a few normal bedrooms, as well as some Versace bean bags, so it was all good in the end. Next up was some beer pong. There's nothing quite as wholesome as throwing a ping pong ball that has been on the ground into a cup and then drinking that tainted liquid. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah. Hit this. Oh. That's how much you suck. <laughs> sorry, There's five cups there. I'm, I'm, so, I'm sorry. Ah! Oh. Can you like an FPS high five? Yeah. I'm just like setting up a trick shot in Call of Duty. Then the unimaginable happened and Stealtho Mato sank the winning cup, beating us. Not even joking, this was probably the lowest point of my entire life. Fortunately, a few more of the boys 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 rocked up to pick back up the mood. How are you going, dummy? Good, mate. Good. Good. A few roadies. What time is it? A couple of tasties. We lost the time a long while ago. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow! 
I then had way too much to drink and sort of forgot to film again, except for this one shot of Stealtho Carbo who had passed out. I'm sure he's pretty delighted that I'm putting this footage on the internet for thousands of people to watch. The next morning. As you can see, everyone was looking a little bit dusty from the night before, so we solved this issue by going straight back to the pub. I think it's also a great time to remind you to drink water between beers and drink responsibly because it's most important to have fun in the sun. You can tell he's a sick because he's got those tattoos. <laughs> wow. I also know this is a gaming channel and not a financial advice channel, but I'm just saying put all your money in these things and you'll almost definitely win $10,000 every time. I know it's cringe, but we also tried to recreate the Sons of Virgins intro. The effort put into this was minimal because of the slight intoxication, but I hope you appreciate the thought. Meet Thick Man, a retired assassin who is on a mission to become the most powerful crime lord in Los Santos, whilst also ensuring he stays sufficiently hydrated at all times. These are the boys boys boys, and together they form a feared gang known as the Sons of Virgins. These are their stories. Bruh. We look like sick It's almost as good as the real thing. <laughs> I'll cheers to that, boys. I'll cheers to that. We'll get the champers going. We'll get the champers going. Cheers, lads. That's all done. Very cheers. I'm not putting this in the video. Not the cruisers. I don't blame you. So, yeah, as I look back through this footage, I realise that I'm kind of an appalling vlogger, but it was really fun to meet up with the lads I game with all the time, and I was actually meeting some of them for the first time ever, which was really cool. Next up, I travelled to Sydney to meet Click and some other YouTubers and streamers. First, I met up with Grace and Rob, who were both legends, for a business meeting. Look at your boy out here having a business meeting. Warren Buffett, take notes, big girl. Then it was time for the Christmas party and I decided that it was high time I upped my game. So one, I decided to get a proper vlogging camera and set up so I could film the whole thing properly. And two, I decided to just drink a little bit so that I could be like a social butterfly and cruise around the event making a really good first impression. Except I wish that was true. I just drank too much and continued to film the whole thing on an iPhone 8. So can I get an F in the comment section? First we did a lawn bowls competition and my teammates were the Master Bucks, Jared HD and iStream, all of whom are absolute legends. No, you'll get banned by copper. You can't do that. <laughs> My vocabulary for describing people is literally either a dodgy malacca or an absolute legend. I should really read a dictionary. If you're wondering why we're dressed so badly, it's because our team outfit theme was Dad's on Vacation, which I think we all did a very bad job of recreating, which is becoming a common theme for this video. Anyway, here's a montage of me going around that Christmas party, shoving a camera in people's face and asking them to say something funny, which is exactly what they would have wanted when they're trying to unwind at a Christmas party. I'm also sunburnt, hungover, and pretty drunk, so it's authentic, but, you know, questionable content continues. Are you putting this on your channel? Yeah, yeah, f***ing out there. Oh, what is up, guys? Are you f oh, yeah, you f I'm f***ing drunk. No, that's alright. No, say something Wait. clever, say something funny. Me? Oh, he's not good at that. I will overtake Josh Stubb to be the biggest VR channel in the world. No, not true. Yo, gang, gang, what's cracker lacking? Big M Dog here in the Sydney hood with my boy. Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. I couldn't have said it better myself. Yeah. Over here, said, but a lot less cringe. Bye. All right, guys. So everyone knows the deal. You got to keep on gaming. All right. So as long as you do that, you're gonna be good. Merry Christmas. Good turn. I'm just happy to be in the video. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was a mean hydration. All right. Ready? This is what you're for, right? Yeah, that's what we're here for. Send it, send it. Oh, look at that sweet hydration. Look at that sick off-white shirt. Let's get it. Can you say something funny, like some great classic height? Right in the. Oh. Right in the.
Welcome to the Modest Pelican Christmas Special. I'm here with Laserbeam, you might have heard of him. I don't know. I've gone back to doing construction. You don't know that. The you fall don't get no of Laserbeam. Yeah. YouTube. It's when the views are down. It didn't the work views out for are him. down, boys. He's back concreting. I'm giving him the leg up he needs right now. It's an honor to be here yeah, on right, the Christmas man. I got special. You back. I got your back. I really appreciate Imagine it. Imagine filming a Christmas special on a fucking phone, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Leave the word. He well, doesn't believe it twice now. He doesn't have like a vlogging camera on us. <laughs> no, no, this is so professional, man. Again, thank you legends for the support on this channel. It just wouldn't be here without you. And I can't stress that enough. A massive shout out to my patrons who support the channel through Patreon. Uh, to any of you guys who are working through this Christmas holidays, I hope you at least get some time off. But again, from the bottom of my heart, thank you legends. Until next time, and as always, stay classy. Bruh.